Guess who's back? Back again. Sam is back. So grab a pen. Hello and welcome to Bulletproof Art. If you don't already know who I am, my name is Sam and I am addicted to bullet journaling. And you have come to a wonderful place. I have transitioned into a new journal and it is a scribbles that matter. My old journal just right, has been through hell and back. This was a moleskin, 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 however you want to say that. I don't think there's any, any right or wrong way to say it, but uh, it's, it's seen better days. This is now my third bullet journal, and this is also one year anniversary of this YouTube channel, and I'm very excited about that. Let's take a moment for a second though. Take two seconds. It's, it's, it takes two seconds. If you uh, look down on the bottom, there's a shiny red button that says subscribe. If you click that and, and maybe the bell next to it, you'll be notified of when I post new videos, which hopefully is going to be a lot more than it used to be. I, uh, I got a new camera because my phone cameras kept, I have an iPhone and the storage kept popping up saying, you don't have any more room to do this. So I was like, okay, time to get a new camera. So I now have a new camera and I have a new space to film and so let's film some things, yeah? I'm going to show you how I did it. You can totally change it up. There's lots of different um, variations of this. I'll put a link down below to my Pinterest thing so that you can click on that and see all the different ideas um, from where I got mine. It's very generic, but without further ado, let's get to it. It has been a minute since I have done a voiceover. Uh, hello! <laughs> uh, so, level 10 life and level 10 goals. I was, I've been wanting to do this for a while and I just didn't exactly know how to start and I kind of went off of the the one video did, that I did last year or I guess it was a series of videos um, the challenge the self-care challenge that I did I kind of followed along with that and I'll leave a link in the card so you can go back and watch that but the level 10 life and the level 10 goals is basically 10 aspects of your life that you want to sort of master or balance out and it helps to create balance in your life so my areas were friends personal growth spirituality finances career romance leisure contribution environment and health and what i did was on the right side i did my goals and i put each of the little subjects and I put down three goals for each of those things or three three items that I could do to achieve those goals and then on the right or on the left side sorry I made these little boxes and I basically just rated myself uh, where I thought I was at the time of filming this video. I filmed this video back in January and it's now the beginning of February. Um, but, so I'll be doing this again soon. If you want me to do my updated version for you, I can do that as well. Um, leave a comment down below and whenever I do that, I'll film that and throw that on here as well. And it will be like a little update. Um, as far as, since you can't read them, I'm going to read them for you. Under friends, my items I have are send cards, say hello once in a while, and attempt to make plans and in, with intent to follow through. Under my personal growth, I have read one book a month, listen to more podcasts, and be more proactive in Epic, which is a uh, psych rehab program that I'm in. For my spirituality, I have meditate often, yoga teacher training, because I've really been wanting to get my yoga teacher's license um, and talk with my higher power more. Under finances, I have pay off K card, pay off a firm, and save $25 a month. Under career, I have make lots of cards, take a brush lettering class, generate $500 in passive income in one month. 
think those are pretty good goals. Under romance, I have do something fun together, cook together, and go for walks, all at least once a week. For leisure, I have play ukulele three times a week, color something a month, and relax. And for contribution, I have do giveaways on YouTube, which I still haven't figured out what to do giveaways on yet, but those will be uh, coming soon. Uh, donations once a month, and give away old clothes. For environment, I have reorganized craft stuff, create a cleaning list, and donate the extra TV stand that I have that's in my kitchen right now. And for health, I have set up doctor checkups, daily yoga, and start meal planning. So those are my goals, and so far since I have done this, I've been doing a lot more, like I have my, I've set up doctor checkups and stuff, I've been doing yoga a lot more, um, I've donated a ton of stuff, more. I've been listening to more podcasts. Speaking of podcasts, this is not sponsored, but uh, if you don't know who Sarah Prout is, you need to look her up because she is amazing. She is the world's leading expert in manifestation. So if you are interested in the law of attraction and manifestation, then she is your go-to gal. Um, again, not sponsored. Uh, I just really enjoy her stuff. So and she has helped me come a long way in my journey to manifesting. So thank you very much, Sarah. I don't know if you're ever gonna watch this or not, but if you do, that is that. Um, anyway, uh, so I color-coded all of these. Friends was blue, personal growth is yellow, spirituality purple, uh, green for finances, orange for career, pink for romance, blue for leisure, purplish for uh, like a mauve, 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 how do you say that color? Uh, contribution, uh, green, another green, a lighter green for environment, and a red for health. And I just colored in the boxes where I thought I was. If the box was all the way filled in, like environment, then that means I was doing an excellent job in that area. But if the box wasn't very much filled in, like uh, friends, then I, that's something I need to work on. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave those down below. I typically answer right away. You can follow me on Instagram. My information can be found in the description box. And as always, you guys have a wonderful day. Stay creative. Bye.